हेलो एवरी वन टोपोलॉजी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक विच वी हैव स्टडीड और विच विल वी विल बी स्टडी इन अवर मैथमेटिक्स लेट एस डिफाइन द मीनिंग दैट इज द वर्ड टोपोलॉजी अ टोपोलॉजी ऑन वी यूज द वर्ड ऑन और समटाइम्स वी यूज इन or sometimes we use a for also a non empty set a topology on a non empty set capital x is a collection tau we use the word tau the symbol like this of a subset of capital x having the following properties very important properties first property is the set capital x and null set should belongs to tau second property the union of the members of tau union of members of tau should be the member of tau so we write the union of members of any sub collection the word sub collection of tau should be the element of tau for this we use the notation if the family we call that family as g lambda provided this lambda belongs to index set is a collection of members of tau if this is a collection of members of tau then its union we use the notation u for union union of this collection that is union of g lambda lambda belongs to index set should be the element of tau okay this is the second condition and the third condition that is for intersection property the intersection of members of tau should be the element of tau so we used to write the intersection of members of any finite sub collection finite sub collection of tau is in tau very important terminologies and this definition is a basic one to study topology let us understand what is the concept behind this if we are writing the term topology it should refers to or it will be refers to the set a topology is nothing but the collection of sets itself a topology on a non empty set it will be derived by a non empty set capital x so capital x is the basic one by capital x we collect some elements that elements also the set right so we are writing a topology on a non empty set capital x is a collection tau of subsets of x right tau is nothing but which is a set collected by x such that we are taking some elements the elements are nothing but sets okay the so we write subsets of x if we are having some set let us consider set capital x x is having three elements let it be a b c right so by this set we need to collect some elements such that we need to consider the subset of x so let us consider some subsets okay uh, we know that mt will always be the subset right i am i'm considering again one more element a okay we can write like this next the singleton set b also one of the subset at and 
singleton set C will be one of the subset of X. Again, set containing two elements A, B, B, the one of the subset of capital X. Then A, A, B, C, which is X itself, which is also one of the subset of X. A, C is one of the subset of X. Again, C, B is also one of the subset of X. Right. So, here we are collecting these subsets okay we are collecting these subsets by x such that such that it should follow some properties first property is x and mt should belongs to tau so let us consider one tau okay one tau which is the collection collection of subsets of x which is tau is the collection of subsets of x in this we need x and mt the first rule x and mt should belongs to tau so x and mt should belongs to tau first rule second rule the union of members of any sub collection of tau is in tau what is the meaning of this if you are considering any subsets from this x, let us consider set A and set B. I am considering two subsets, these two subsets. If we, if we consider union of any of these, union of any of these should be the element of this itself. What is the meaning? Okay, okay. Let's consider the union of X and MT. Union of X and MT is X itself, right? Yes. Union of X and singleton set A. Then union of these two is X itself. X is there. Here. Union of X and B, which is X itself. See here X is there. Again, union of singleton set A and singleton set B is set containing two elements AB. AB is not in there. So, this will not become the topology tau. If this tau containing this subset AB, set containing two elements AB, then it will hold the second property. That is, union of members of any sub-collection of tau is in tau. Okay, consider any of this, any of this, it will satisfy this rule. Union of any two sets belongs to this set itself, tau itself. Okay, next, third rule, third rule. The intersection of members of any finite sub-collection of tau is in tau. What is the meaning here? intersection consider any two any two sets which belongs to tau say x and mt intersection of x and mt is mt itself so mt belongs to tau only therefore this property holds intersection of set containing a and set containing b here no common element right so intersection of a and b singleton set b is empty itself empty belongs to tau again intersection of x and set containing two elements a b x and this these two its inter intersection is x containing three these three elements right here a b is common among these two so set containing a b will be the value of intersection of x and set containing two elements so here set containing two elements will be the answer but tau also contains this um, set containing two elements a b therefore this collection satisfies all the prop three properties of the definition topology so we call this tau as the topology on on capital x Okay, the order pair x comma tau, ordered pair x comma tau is called topological space. If tau is a topology on x, then the members of tau are called tau open sets. Members of tau are called tau open sets or sometimes we directly call as open sets. Open sets in 
x or open subsets of x itself okay this is the definition of topology based on this definition we find some more concepts in our next videos